<coughs> Excuse me. Okay. So, it's this baby. This is the second plant I have. Like that one. And, <clears throat> I don't know. But, I, I will say that I am convinced that this crack that this pot has, which lets water drain out of it every time I... I fill her up with water, or it rains. This plant likes a lot better, because they were both the same size plant that I had bought from um, Ace Hardware. Uh, so, this one is not doing as well. I drilled five holes with the biggest drill bit I had for that potted plant, and I, I but I didn't put anything underneath the or over the holes inside the plant, um, pot. So I'm thinking that it's either clogged up, the holes are, or um, sitting on the concrete like that without something to take it off, without holes like, like we have here inside here for the water to drain off of, that it kind of keeps it without being able to drain. I don't know, that's just my theory on it. Um, but you can see the the difference. There's a huge, sorry about that, uh, with my um, shadow, but you can see a huge difference. They were bought at the same time, and they were the same size, and look at that growth. Okay, moving on. Now, Yes, there are weeds in my bed. I have not weeded in about a a week or so. But we're going to just carry on. So this is my National Pickling Cucumber that I'm growing. Um, I meant to do a Market More Cucumber. But that's what I ended up planting. So... We're going to go with it. Now, I might have done one here, but I don't actually remember. That's why I'm making little notes like this. And I would suggest putting the dates when you planted the seed also on this little tag. So you can remember what you planted for number one. And number two, the date you planted it. But there's that baby. If you know what that little baby is growing up right there, please... Uh, leave a comment down below and let me know. Okay, moving on to the right is the big tomato. Right here. Bam! Look at these. They're growing. And then you got flowers coming on it. Look at that. And I am using this um, arch panel trellis, or this cow panel arch trellis system to see how this is going to work out. For these tomatoes, um, especially the vining tomatoes. So, moving on to the other side of bed number, which we were in bed number two or bed B, whatever you want to call it. I have kind of like the mirror effect going on, but we have BAM, we have our marigolds. Now, the marigolds in this bed were planted. At the same time, I planted the ones over there in that bed. I don't know if it's the the soil over here. I use the same soil. Um, maybe, I don't know. Maybe it's because they got stomped on. the. We have big dogs on the family compound here in Leisha Land. And they have trailed through this garden bed when there was nothing growing in it. So they might have compacted the soil. Um, so they might the roots might have a hard time growing. Then again, I haven't really dug down too far deep in the ground, in this ground to find out what's going on. So I don't know. Maybe it's too tough for them to grow. But it's like one bed is doing better. And then again, I don't know. Maybe it's the way the sunlight hits them during the day. I mean, I did a, a, what do you call it? Hmm. What did I do? Oh, I did, uh, I kind of tested where the sun laid in the sky. 
uh, at 9, at noon, at 3, and at 6 p.m. Uh, to find out how the sun hits. And I plant, that's why I planted where I planted everything. So, maybe it's getting too much sun or not enough. But this is another Tabasco pepper plant. Not doing as well as the other one. They were the same size in the other bed. Uh, they were planted at the same time. Same thing with my black pearl over there. And, yes, of course, I got a lot of weeds I got to and whatever they're called that I got to pull out of here. Whatever. It is. I have no idea. I just know it needs to come out. And it's a lot of work. So, but it's very rewarding work. Now, moving on. I'm going to show you this little bitty black pepper plant. Or black pearl, rather. So, she is getting some of these coming on there. Now, I'm not sure if I should pick any of these or if I should just let them grow. If you think I should pick a couple of these peppers, um, please leave a comment in the bottom. Um leave yeah leave me a comment down below and let me know if i should pick them um since they are the first peppers of this plant or if i should just let them go leave them be and let them go so oh having a hard time getting up now Woo, okay back behind the cow panel arch trellis is my lantana this is the lantana that i got from my mom easter sunday and she actually has i think really doubled in size now we were my mom wasn't sure if we could um cut any of the green off of the lantana and plant it in soil and uh, see if it would grow but she is really growing I don't know what all that brown stuff is right there, but it looks like something has got a hold of her. But she's really for the butterfly garden that I am working on establishing for Leisha Land. Um, so, yeah, there is my butterfly. I mean, my lantana. Okay. Oh, and then look at that. I don't know. Well, I'm not going to be able to do that, but up underneath here is... A place that we have some kind of spiders, I think, going on. It looks like spider webs. Spider web, spider web. Um, chasing spider webs, is that a song? Let me know in the comment. <laughs> I can't remember. I've slept since then, guys and gals. So, all right. Next up on the tour is, give me a second. Dun, oh, drum roll. Let's give a drum roll. I'm not a drummer. I can't give you a drum roll. But da 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 da. Wow, this is the black creme. Look at these. They are growing like crazy. I mean, I only have four, but I do have more flowers coming on. So I got flowers here on it, flowers back here, flowers back here. It's really doing awesome. Um, so, yeah. That's really crazy. And then, I need to really clean my phone, guys. Because that's what I'm using to do these tours. And I can't really see the screen. Especially in sunlight. But, <clears throat> if you're wondering about the laundry basket. Okay, there is a purpose for this laundry basket. And I just haven't established the purpose yet exactly. But I am planning on using it for either a flower bed or my sweet potato bed. Putting some plastic in it and filling it up with soil. I just got to get the soil. And then I had to get my tomatoes out of these cups and... I don't know what possessed me to do this, honestly. I have no clue. <laughs> but, um, so, 
These are tomatoes. They're the mystery tomato because I don't know what type of tomato they are because, like I said earlier, you need to make sure that you, um, yeah, write on a some type of thing, a popsicle stick or uh, plastic or whatever, so you can name your tomatoes and date, or name your vegetables and date them. But there's three of these bad boys that I had growing from seed in a cup. And yes, I know that I need to space them out. But I'm tired, and I just got home from church. And we had a gradu a pre-graduation party for my daughter. And in the spur of the moment, I was just like, I need to get these out because they were bigger than my tomatoes that are in the cups already. And then it started raining. That's why I just threw them in there um, like that because I guess I'm sugar and I, I'll melt if I get wet. So, yeah, not really, but it sounded good. But there's my squash. I have, how many plants of squash do I have in here? Now, I don't know if I, I have, this is the first time I'm growing squash, guys. And it's from Ace Hardware. No, not Ace, Community Hardware off of Community Drive in New Caney. Um, so, I have one, two, okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. So, six squash plants, and they're the yellow crookneck squash plants. Um, this is just me trying and seeing if I can grow them up. I don't know if it's going to work or not. We will see. Now to the left of the squash is the better bog. Look at that. Bam. 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 We have bam. Bam. We have, um, yeah, flowers going on in this better bog, um, ace bucket. So, they look kind of, I watered them yesterday. I mean, the, it is wet, but it's damp, but 